Hey everyone, it's Veronica. Welcome back to my channel. This is my first sit down video that I'm filming in my college dorm. I'm sorry that I've been so MIA. I've just been so overwhelmed with school and getting into the groove of things, but I love it here in college. And yeah, it's just been a lot of fun. And I'm finally getting around to getting my YouTube back on schedule. So I'm gonna try to film and upload once a week. So, um,. No promises, but that is my goal. So, um, yeah, today I just have a haul for you guys. I've gotten a few things since I've moved in, and this is just, like, my clothing haul, and I kind of want to film, like, a dorm room haul. So, um, just, like, dorm room necessities. Like, I want to show you, like, what I use every day, like, my Brita filter and my electric kettle, things like that. Comment down below and let me know if you guys want to see that, and I'll tell you, like, what I use every single day. So, um, you guys will know, like, what to buy and what not to buy for college. And, um... Yeah, and I don't know how this lighting is. I have to import this footage onto my computer and then check it out. This is all natural lighting. I mainly use natural lighting back at home, but um, I hope you guys like this setup. I have like my bed right there. It is so bland and I have no throw pillows, mainly because I'm from out of state and I'm not gonna pack an entire suitcase filled with throw pillows. That is just so dumb. And I'm not gonna buy some here because how am I supposed to bring them back home? So yeah, I just did not waste any money doing that. I did not really decorate my room, but I kind of wanna film like a dorm room so let me know if you guys want to um, see that. This is a really long and in this is a really long and rambly intro, but um, yeah, let's just get on to the video. So the first thing that I got actually before I left were some Nikes, and I did haul them before, but I actually have them to show you guys. And these are just my Nike Flyknit free runs, and I love them. Just kidding, I actually kind of regret them now. Like. Uh, I know I shouldn't have gotten them, but they were $130, and now that I've been wearing them a lot, I wish they had more support. I'm just telling myself to love them because I can't return them. I've had them for like two months. So, um, yeah, they just look like this. I mean, they are cute, but they have no support, and I have really weak ankles, and I work out every day, so I don't know. But when I go home for Thanksgiving, I'm definitely bringing my free runs over, like just my normal free runs. I like those way more. Like, they're just better for working out. I feel like these are cuter. But, I don't know, I kind of regret spending $130 on these because I just keep on comparing them to my hunters and I cannot justify spending nearly the same amount of money for these thin little running shoes and some nice durable rain boots. So, I don't know. But, they're cute and they're nice to have, I guess. So, like I said, I bought some hunter rain boots just like I mentioned earlier and I love them. They just came in the mail like a few days ago. Today was the first day that I wore them. They're just the classic hunters and they are the matte black and I love them. Um, I also got some inserts actually. Let me go and grab them. Oh, and I'm also not wearing any makeup other than my eyebrows because I'm a college student. I don't have time to like get all dolled up and yeah I just like I don't know I do have days where I put makeup on but I just didn't want to put makeup on just for a video I used to do that back in um, high school but I don't know I just cannot do that here because I have to work out later so it makes no sense to pile on a bunch of makeup and then wash it all off but um with my hunter boots those were 150 I love them and I think they will be so versatile I got some boot socks and I just got some one um, boot socks in grayish and they are just like a really cute knit boot sock and hopefully these will last me through the winter I don't know cuz I'm in Illinois so it will snow crazy hard it was so cold today it was like 68 degrees and I was literally the only one who was wearing like boots and things like that and I was wearing this crew neck and everyone else was in like tank top and shorts and I was like <laughs> What the hell? Like, why am I the only person who's, like, bundled up? I don't know. And I have my friend who's also from California, and she was wearing her Patagonia snap tee. So, yeah, we are obviously not prepared for the winter, but... I got these for now, like my boot socks and my hunters for the winter. I feel like it's not going to be enough, especially because I heard this winter is going to be really bad. But if it does get to that point, then um, I'm probably just going to buy Sorrels. I was going to buy bean boots, but I think I'm just going to buy some Sorrel boots. So if I do buy them, I'll haul them. But um, yeah, as of right now, my hunters are going to last me until December, until I go home. And then when I come back, I heard it's like coldest during January and February. Then I'm going to order Sorrels if I need them. You know what I mean? So that's it for my shoes. Now onto like body care, I guess you can say. And um, I got this Coors Body Butter and I love it. This was actually sent to me by Octoly to review, but I genuinely love it. And I've been using it a lot. It doesn't smell that appealing to be honest, but um, I really like it because it's so thick and I normally just put it on before bed and in the morning because the 
the scent is so light it's already gone and I just wake up with really nice and moisturized skin and there's not really a scent so I like this a lot and it's a little bit pricey but if you guys are looking for a good thick body moisturizer I would definitely recommend this they also sent me the Healthy Sexy Hair Soy Renewal Beach Spray with Argan Oil. And I love this because I absolutely love beach spray. I'm going to do a demonstration with like my hair care routine. I'm going to have that go up really soon. But um, yeah, I love this because beach spray tends to be really like drying and because they're salt, you know, salt spray, things like that. But I like how this has Argan Oil so it does not like dry out your hair. Okay, I'm stumbling so much because I haven't filmed a YouTube video in months, but um... Yeah, love this, definitely recommend. So the last thing that they sent me was actually this Turby Twist, and I like it a lot. They actually sent me the wrong thing. I wanted the Turby, um, like the turban, but they sent me this headband, and I've actually been using it a lot. I just put it back in the package just to show you guys, and this is great because you can put it on and then use it, and like do your makeup, wash your face, and you won't get your hair wet, which is so nice, especially at night when I don't work out and I don't want to shower, and yeah, this is just so great, and I love it. And it's in this really pretty purple color, and yeah, I... It's very useful and I use it every night. So I actually went to Urban Outfitters because the only clothing store near my college campus is Urban Outfitters. So yeah, I am just gonna go broke because that's seriously the only place I have other than the mall that's like a 30 minute bus right away. So I'm probably never gonna go there. But I got the Pistachio Brulee Hair and Body Mist and I freaking love this perfume. Let me show you guys up close. Look at the packaging, super cute. And um, it smells so good. It's very warm and it's like it has a very warm vanilla set. I think this will be perfect for the winter But one thing that I really do not like about this perfume is that I have a rash from using it. This happened during um, the first week of rush and Yeah, let me know if you guys want me to make a video about rush. I dropped. I'm so happy I did Let me know if you guys want me to tell you guys about my rush experience So yeah, but um, I like this a lot, but now I don't know I keep on itching at my neck which is why it's not getting better it's been like three weeks since rush since I got this but I just spray it on all my clothes now and I still smell good without getting a rash and I love this and yeah it was $22 for this big bottle and such a great purchase I'm telling you I also bought a hydro flask because yeah you need a water bottle to stay hydrated and this is great I just got the matte white color I really like it and super cute it's not really that big here but I mean a lot of people from California have hydro flasks but like I don't know everyone here just I don't know no one here uses hydro flasks flasks other than me and my California friends but I love it and it's the 24 ounce I'm pretty sure 24 ounce so it's huge and a lot of the time I like to my nose is really itchy um I, a lot of the time I like to put tea in it because I've been sick for the past two or three weeks so I'll put tea in it and I'll put like three tea bags because there's so much um water so you need a lot of tea bags just to balance it out but I love this this is $30 on Amazon and I already have a dent in it and I have like dents all over the bottom but I'm telling myself that it just adds character and I need to start stop worrying about the dents but yeah it's really cute and I love it and I use it every single day for tea water everything my last and final thing in this haul is actually this crew neck and it is just a simple Illinois crew neck it is like this gray crew neck with blue undertones and it just has Illinois written in orange because I don't know if you guys can tell but I do go to the University of Illinois I didn't say that in any other video so I guess I'm announcing it in this video but I attend the University of Illinois Urbana-Champaign and it's been great so far I love it let me know if you guys want me to make a video on that I don't know just leave me some comments down below and tell me what you guys want to see but I love this crew neck I've been wearing it a ton especially after my workouts because after I work out it's really late because I work out from 10 p.m. till midnight but um I always come home sweaty and I don't want to get sick with like the sweat and the cold air even though it feels good I feel like I'm gonna get sick and I am sick so this is just like my post-workout crew neck and I just put this on and I go home and I love this crew neck so yeah it's great and it was very affordable and yeah so that's it for this video I hope you guys all enjoyed watching don't forget to leave me some comments down below send me some love and like this video and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already oh and you guys should also check out my Instagram I'll link that down below okay thanks so much have a great day I will talk to you guys in my next video Bye.